This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. Mayor Todd Gloria says next week's homeless encampment sweep in the Midway District is suspended. Crews have been clearing the area on Tuesdays and Thursdays, but next Thursday is the annual point in time count. And that's an in person survey of how many people are living on the streets. Gloria says the sweep will be suspended to get a complete and accurate count. Well, women in the college area say they're feeling unsafe after San Diego police released pictures of a man suspected of peeping into windows at night. Police want to talk to this man accused of prowling and peering into several homes less than a mile away from San Diego State. Now, students living in the area are warned to be more mindful to look out for one another when they are home. Anyone with information or who may have been a victim is asked to call the San Diego Police Department. Well, the fight over how much fencing to put up along Del Mar's famous coastal bluffs could be coming to an end. City of Del Mar is expected to accept a plan for fencing along the tracks. The original proposal was a six foot fence along the entire stretch of tracks. But after some pushback, residents who said the fence would obstruct the view, uh, the North County Transit District came up with a different plan for a fence that is shorter and less obtrusive. Del Mar City Council could discuss this on Monday. Let's check in with Megan now as we look at all those pretty pictures oh, and the nice weather. I know, Del Mar is so beautiful. Yeah. yeah, I know. And today is going to be a nice one to get out and enjoy America's finest city. I mean, it is going to be a beautiful Friday. Temperatures in the 70s this afternoon for the coast, inland, and desert areas. Pretty nice in the mountain areas as well in the 50s. And we are going to see fair weather continue into the weekend, though today and tomorrow will be the warmer days. Cooling begins on Sunday as a cold winter storm will bring much chillier temperatures next week. We're talking about highs in the 50s, along with periods of rain and mountain snow. That's looking mostly late Tuesday into Wednesday. Jim? Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News mobile app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.